As the wheel of Dharma turns from the east to the west, Alexavar Rinpoche, an incarnate Lama and Geshe from the Sarajay Monastic University in India, visits our Buddhist center for the third time from October 23rd to 28th, 2013. The unbroken lineage of the authentic teachings given by Rinpoche originate from Buddha Shakyamuni himself passing down through oral transmissions from great teachers of the past to Lama Jai Songkhapa, His Holiness the Dalai Lama, Kyapje Trichun Rinpoche, Geshe Urgin Satan, Geshe Lopsang Palden and others. To connect with Alok Rinpoche through his teachings is like being born in the noble lineage family, an act symbolized by the spiritual names given to each new Sangha member by Rinpoche. While the students anxiously await his presence, Rinpoche enters joyfully, followed by Dragutin Shmalsel, the founder and spiritual mentor of our society, whose spiritual ties with Rinpoche goes back over two decades during the time of Dragutin's studies in Sera Monastery. In a serene environment, in accordance with the traditions, Rinpoche is offered symbolic representations of the body, speech and mind of the Buddha, followed by an extensive mandala offering of the universe. The teachings were directly translated from Tibetan to Croatian by Dragutin Shmalsel. Alok Rinpoche began with the refuge ceremony, which opens the door to the Buddha Dharma, followed by the Pratimoksha and the Bodhisattva vows. After all, it is the Bodhicitta, the mind of altruistic intention and actions, which forms the foundation for the Mahayana path. This was followed by a concise and detailed explanation of the nine branches of primary practices in the Galup tradition, along with the empowerment emphasizing on the Guru Yoga through the root text Gandhan Lajema, the king of all prayers. As a part of the primary practices, Rinpoche bestowed the tantric empowerment and teachings on the deity Vajrasattva in union with his consort. This practice is of vital importance to purify the past negativities and to lessen the future negative tendencies. For if the vessel is not pure, whatever is added in that vessel will get contaminated. This practice was given according to the oral transmission received from the great yogi Panang Rinpoche. During the empowerment ceremony, the students transcend ordinary perceptions perceiving the Lama and the deity Yidam of being of the same essence. The Sangha members demonstrate the hand mudra, symbolizing the mandala offering of the universe and all precious substances. The imaginative offering is a skillful method to increase one's merit, the spiritual momentum required to obtain all virtuous qualities. To understand the Dharma and to practice it requires study, concentration, effort and dedication which is undertaken and well appreciated by the Sangha members of our society. Time is of the essence, it passes so quickly so it's best not to waste it in meaningless activities. The teachings and empowerments ended with the soak offering rituals conducted in accordance with the Lama Chepa text. The melodious chantings, accompanied with the sounds of drum and bell, symbolizing wisdom and method, echoed to move the heart of the female wisdom beings, the Dakinis, to evoke their blessings.
the tantric teachings and initiations implant the seeds in the mind of practitioners to recognize their own divine nature which is inherent in every living being. Filled with loving kindness, Rinpoche granted each student a blessed protection thread along with a picture of the Buddha Shakyamuni as a reminder of their vows and commitment to practice the Dharma. Tashi Dalek. Tashi Dalek.